I recently attended an inclusion day for individuals with disabilities and one of the guests at the event asked me a question about a phone case or cases or accessories that would be good for individuals that are elderly or have orthopedic issues. The specific question was, is there a case that her friend who is in a wheelchair and also has some orthopedic issues uh, can use? Now, this is no medical advice and I'm not an OT or anything like that. I just wanted to look into my collection and see what cases could be of benefit. Some things to keep in mind when considering cases include its durability, uh, its design, also whether it has textured sides, also good grip, and anything that reduces the chances of the phone slipping. This first case I purchased on Amazon for $10. It is a wave design and it is made of soft silicone. So as you see, it's easy for me to grip with one hand and it's not as likely to slip out of my hand based on the fact that the waves are present in its design and my fingers are able to grip the case better. This is an OtterBox case and it is durable as well as somewhat slim. Uh, it offers good protection without being too bulky. Its textured sides provide a better grip, which reduces the chances of the phone slipping. And again, if it does, it is well protected. This next case here, I purchased from the Dollar Tree. So it was a dollar and 25 cents, but as you see, it has a resin chain link on the back of the case which is good for sliding your hand in between so you can actually hold the case very securely as you're using it so I do like that and the actual case is pretty slim so as you see I can use the case without fear of dropping it or it slipping out of my hand. This next one I purchased on Amazon for $11. It is a 3D vintage camera phone case with a hand strap. So what I like about it is if someone is uh, traveling or navigating and instead of holding the phone in their hand, they can basically use the strap to carry the device versus holding it in their hand directly. So. I think this is really a good alternative for individuals who have issues with holding or gripping devices. So they can just, for example, drape it on their arm or on their wheelchair and they can continue with their travels. This next case I designed on my own. I purchased a clear silicone case from Five Below and I added different jewels to it. So I bought the jewels at Michael's, but it also gives the device grip. As you see, I have different stones on it. So if you're holding the device, of course it's slippery on the side, but you can always design it where you can add stones to the sides of the device. And of course, on the back of the device, the stones also add some traction so it can help prevent slipping or dropping the device as well. Next, this case actually has an attachment. So this is a travel strap. So all you have to do is attach the strap to the bottom of the case. So if you're traveling, then all you have to do is throw the strap over your head so you can wear it um, on your shoulder or you can wear it as a crossbody. But it's great when using a device and if you are out and about or if you're moving around or even if you're just sitting in one spot, the strap is helpful in the event that you drop the device. So 
the good thing is it is still on your body so you can just grab the phone again and continue to use it without it falling onto the floor. And this is just another example of a phone a lanyard. As you see, this one sticks to the back of the case. This accessory is actually an armband, so you can use this while you're traveling with your device. So as you see, I placed the iPhone inside the pouch. And of course, all you have to do is zip it closed. And once you do that, you can slide the armband over one of your arms and it fits very snug and it allows you to travel with your device and it remains on your person at all times. This is actually a combination of two different accessories. So this black pouch I purchased on Amazon and it holds multiple devices, but you can use it with just one if you'd like, and you can use the other pockets to store your other personal items. But I also, if you flip it on the back, you see that I attached a lanyard to it. So you can just throw the lanyard around your body so you can use it as a crossbody or around your shoulder or however you like and it is good for traveling with your device as well so back to the otter box case this actually came with a clip so that could be used as something that is good to clip on to different uh, surfaces, or you can use it to hold. The clip is not as accessible or as easy to hold the clip itself, but you might be able to clip it onto a surface to use the device. This accessory is also another type of armband. So as you see, it has Velcro straps. It's meant for runners or joggers or walkers who are active but you can always use it in any manner that you like so as you see i am demonstrating how you can uh, attach it to your wrist or you can attach it to your upper arm however you like but it's another option for using your device or you can just hold the plastic on the back in your hand and it provides a grip as well Believe it or not, I don't own a pop socket, but I wanted to show you what they look like. Um, all you have to do is affix it to the back of a case. You pop it out and slide it between your fingers to add extra support while using your device. And lastly, here's an example of a tabletop stand for your device. So all you have to do is place your device on the stand and you can proceed with using the device without fear of it falling or dropping. So that's it for this video. If you have any other suggestions for helpful cases, please leave your suggestions in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching this video. Bye-bye.